I'm Pete Renshaw. I work for Portron Composites. Uh, we are the developer and manufacturer of the Mateen product range. We're working with Sigma Development Group here in the US. I graduated with an honours degree in physics and since then I've spent almost 20 years in the composites industry, specialising in the development of high performance engineering products for specialist construction applications. Glass transition temperature tells us when the dowel begins to soften due to heat. A resin system with a relatively high glass transition temperature should be selected. The glass transition temperature is also a measure of the resin matrix cure. Full resin cure is essential for long-term durability. There are various methods of testing for resin cure. The recommended method is dynamic mechanical thermal analysis, or more commonly known as DMTA. A lot of information is generated during a DMTA test, but what we are interested in is the glass transition temperature from the storage modulus graph. The storage modulus glass transition temperature should be over 212 Fahrenheit or 100 degrees centigrade. The second graph is also generated during the test, which gives the glass transition temperature in terms known as tan delta. Tan delta is typically 35 to 55 Fahrenheit or 20 to 30 degrees centigrade higher than the storage modulus glass transition.